हे वॉस गोइन एन गाज वेलकम बैक द ब्रांड न्यू सीजन इन फोर्थ नाइट सीजन थ्री चैप्टर टू सो गाज आई एम बैक विद ब्रांड न्यू वीडियो सो हेयर टू इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गिंग टू शेयर यू द बेस्ट सेटिंग फॉर फोर्थ नाइट सीजन थ्री हाउ कैन यू बूस्ट अप योर एफ पी एस हाउ कैन यू फिक्स आउट दी स्टार्टर और इनपुट डिले इन योर गेम इन फोर्थ नाइट सीजन थ्री चैप्टर टू सो गाज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इफ यू आर न्यू ऑन माई चैनल सो मे शो सब्सक्राइब इट लाइक दिस वीडियो एंड गाइज just follow out all of these step which i'm going to show you into this video very carefully because uh, every step is uh, for you is very important and play a very important role to boosting up your fps and fix out your problems in fortnite so guys with wasting any time let's go straight into this video so simple first of all you need to go for the settings of the games and here is the windows mode so first of all you need to set out the windows mode onto the full screen because uh, for this video sake i am just using the window full screen but i will recommend you 100% to use the windows full screen and use out uh, which resolution you want here so just after doing it you need to go here for the frame rate limit if you have the texture loading problem on your pc your texture not rendering when you play game so just when you uh, jump from the bus uh, before this you need to just set it your fps on 60 fps and just after landing on to the ground in fortnite just set it on to the 120 fps or any fps limit you want 140 fps or 240 fps according to your pc specs so just after doing it here is the brightness setting uh, color blind and other settings and here is the other most important setting which is the graphics quality so just from here i am just probably use the uh, low settings on my pc i also recommend you to use uh, everything low and just set the 3d resolution onto the 100% just after doing it here is the advanced setting and it also very important setting for you to fix out your uh, shutter input delay or fps boost so just follow out all of these settings and just watch this video carefully so just first of all you need to turn off the vsync because it's lock your fps Uh, onto your uh, 60 according to your monitor here so i am going to recommend you to just turn it off here is the motion blur turn it off here is the uh, show fps just turn it on according to your needs and here is the direct x version just set it on to the direct x 11 because direct x uh, 12 have a lot of issues uh, with this and here is the allow multi threading options just uh, turn it off because it will uh, cause a lot of fps drops or stutters in your game so just you need to uh, turn it off here is the uh, use gpu crashing debugging just turn it also off and just apply out this setting just after doing it here is the other setting which i'm going to uh, show you also because a lot of people comment me down uh, to show my in game setting so here is my movement setting combat setting building tutorial and extra game option settings you can also follow out these settings here is the replay setting also turn off all of these replays because it is also help out you to fixing out the stutters and also uh, boost your 10 to 15 fps in your game so i just probably uh, recommend you to turn all of the uh, record replay la large team replay and the creative record uh, mode replay also just turn all of the settings off and here is my sensitive replay setting you can also follow out this x axis and the y axis sensitive I am using this setting probably from the last two weeks, and it will help me to getting the best aim and best lasering in the game. So just after doing it, now let's go on our uh, Windows settings and just optimize our game for best performance. So guys, now I am on my home screen. So just you need to follow out these settings. So first of all, uh, just locate uh, out your Fortnite location where you install it. So I am install it on my local disk app. So here is the Epic Games folder and Fortnite. So just after uh, going into this, from here you need to go for the Fortnite games. binary win64 and here is the fortnite directory and just now you need to follow out all of my these steps because i am going to change out some property setting of these files just go into the properties of this file go into the compatibility and now just from here you need to disable out the full screen optimization change high dp setting and just also check mark this one click okay click apply this setting again and now just after doing it now go back into the next file properties and just follow out again the setting disable out the full screen optimization change high dpi and our wide high dpi scaling behavior just check mark here and just do the same settings for next this uh, two files so just after doing it you need to close out this window and now you need to go for the window settings go into the gaming tab and from here you need to go for the game mode and just turn off this game mode from here because it is not help out you to boosting up your fps uh, it is not uh, help out you in any type of the process so just turn it off now go into your pc properties or device manager so just right click here on the windows icon go into the device manager go for the display devices and from here disable out the high precision event timer from here because it is also help out you a lot to boosting up your fps 
on your PC. Next, guys, now we are going to uh, reduce the input delay in our game. So just you need to download uh, these uh, ISLC, which is the Intelligent uh, Standby List Cleaner. So just download this on your PC. I am going to give you this pack into the description. So guys, just after downloading this uh, pack from the description, first of all, you need to stop out the process of the uh, intelligence standby list cleaner. So just after stopping out it, and uh, here is some match. So guys, make sure to just watch out this carefully because it is also help out you a lot to fixing out the input delay in your game in Fortnite season three. So just first of all, here is the list size is at least, and here is the free memory is lower than. So just you need to type here the. Uh, total uh, size of your RAM in MBs. I have 8 GB of RAM, so just I'm going to also give you the pack or this text file into the boost pack. You can also use out this, just copy out the values from here and just paste out it here. So I have 8 GB of uh, RAM, so I just converted it into the MBs. And here is the half size of my RAM in MBs, which is the uh, I divided uh, I divided this value with two and I'm get this result. So just paste here this one and now go for the one time resolution and just uh, set here zero. 50 value because this is the main thing which will help you to uh, decreasing out your input delay in your game so just after doing it just click here on the enable button click here on the start button and just minimize it in your background so guys uh, whenever you start your pc and want to play your game so just make sure to run this intelligent standby list cleaner in your background because i also set it and pin it in my uh, window screen so you can also see here intelligence standby list cleaner just open up this go into the more and run this ad administrator and it will running in your background whenever you want to you play your game so just after doing it i hope so guys this video really helped out you to boosting up your fps and fixing out your problem in fortnite season 3 if you have any type of question in your mind so just ask me in the comment section make sure to like this video also make sure to subscribe to my channel so guys till at the next video allah hafiz and bye bye